Today is the day. Today, you guys finally get to see this long-awaited video that I teased back in November. Today, I'll be discussing the meaning of this image. A picture of Steve from Minecraft presumably punching this man so hard he breaks the concrete of the pavement and smashes into this fence. Question is, how strong would Steve need to be to accomplish this? Also, we're gonna ignore the fact that this guy is definitely dead. So, to figure out how Steve did this, we need to know what Steve used to hit this guy. His fist. How big is it and how fast and hard did he punch? It is canon that a Minecraft block is a meter cubed, a meter wide, a meter tall, and a meter long. The side of a block is 16 pixels, so I'll use that as a measurement. 16 pixels is 1 meter. Steve is 1.8 blocks tall, making him about 6 foot 4 or 193 centimeters, and the average weight for someone that size is about 210 pounds. Steve's arm is 12 pixels long, meaning it's 3 quarters of a meter or 75 centimeters. It's also 4 pixels long and 4 pixels wide, which is a quarter of a meter or 25 centimeters. So, Steve's arm is 75 centimeters by 25 centimeters by 25 centimeters for a surface area of 46,875 centimeters cubed. If Steve weighs about 210 pounds and the mass of his arm is about 7.245 kilograms or around 16 pounds. Now we gotta know how fast he's punching. The average punching speed of a human is 9.14 meters per second or about 33 kilometers an hour or 20 miles per hour. Using a stopwatch I measure the time it took for Steve to punch to be about 0.1 seconds. So all we gotta do now is divide how fast he punches by 0.1 seconds and we get 91.4. Now all we gotta do is multiply that by the mass of Steve's arm, which is 7.245 kilograms, to see that Steve punches with a force of about 662 newtons. However, that shows that Steve is actually punching with only about a third of the force required to break pavement. So Steve shouldn't be strong enough, except... Steve can carry a cubic meter of gold in his pockets, which weighs in about 19.3 tons. Not only that, but he can carry 36 stacks of gold blocks, which means Steve can carry 44,467.2 tons in his pockets, which is 436,074,268 newtons, which is 229,512 times more newtons needed to break concrete. But wait, shulker boxes can be filled with 27 stacks of gold blocks, which you can then fit 36 of those shulker boxes into his inventory, which means Steve can carry over 1,200,640 metric tons, which is 11 billion 774 million 1317 newtons which is 6 million 196 thousand 842 times more than needed to break concrete so not only is this image entirely possible the guy he punches more than certainly vaporized at the surface of the earth <laughs>